Barry from Jesus in Montana. Who's your fringe crush this year? My fringe crush is uh, it's uh, the guy with the cheese on his head. Um, and I don't really, I'm not really into guys, and I'm lactose intolerant, but something about the combination of the two, I think he's doing a show called Pentecostal Wisconsin, I, and it's just the, the cheese in the head, it's, it's really cool, and uh, I hope he doesn't find out, because the lactose thing is bad. So tell us a little bit about your show. My show is called Jesus in Montana. It's, it's a true story, Jesus in Montana. Fifteen years ago, I was in a religious cult, and I believe that, well, members of this cult believe that Jesus had returned and was living in Montana. So I quit my job, left my girlfriend, moved up to Montana, hitchhiked up to Montana, actually, met this Jesus guy, lived in his basement for a summer, actually accepted him as my personal Lord and Savior because these things happen. Uh, for about three years, I believe this guy really was Jesus. I don't believe it anymore, which is why I'm not handing out very different pamphlets than these. But I wrote a comedy show about it, Jesus in Montana. It's a multimedia show, so everything that would hopefully lead you through my decision-making process of how I came to be living in Jesus' basement, and then luckily stopped. Uh, my show won the Outstanding Solo Show at the New York Fringe in 2005. I sold out shows in Vancouver and Montreal, and now I'm here in Orlando in the Yellow Vineyard. Awesome. True story. Thanks a lot, True Barry. True story, comedy, Jesus cult. That's all you do.